Did I ever tell you guys about that time I got robbed? Ha <laughs> ha! Dangly parts. So as most of you guys may know, I own a music and lifestyle blog called Fly Little Things. And within the past year, I've been blessed with the opportunity to interview some of my favorite rappers. A couple of months ago, I got invited to an album listening party in New York. And usually I don't like going to these events by myself. So I call up my boy Jay, tell him to come scoop me and we'll go to the album listening party together. Now, since Jay lives in a different town than I do, he's about 30, 25 minutes away from me. So during that time, I was like, let me freshen up and take a shower. So let's fast forward about 20 minutes. And when I get out the shower, I hear this loud ass sound from outside my parents' window. And my parents' window is right next to the bathroom that everybody uses and it's facing the front of the house. So I hear this loud sound coming from outside my parents' window. And it sounded like a loud sawing sound. And at first I didn't really think anything of it because the neighbors across the street were moving some stuff in a U-Haul truck. So I thought that was them, you know, continuing doing whatever they're doing. So I, you know, dismissed the sound once and I go back to, you know, putting on my clothes and drying myself off and everything. And then I hear the sound again and I was just like, okay, what the hell is that sound? So I walk over to my parents' window, look down, and at the exact moment I look down, I see a crackhead and a brown trench coat pull the storm drain off the front of my house, hop on a purple bike, and continue to jet down my street. What the actual fuck? I, I, I don't, I don't know. I mean, and the crazy part is we live on the top of a hill and at the bottom of the hill, there's an intersection with no stoplights. So uh, the fact that he just jetted down my block without a care in the world with a storm drain on his back is ridiculous. It was just so crazy. Like when I saw it happen, my window was closed and I wanted to like yell out like, hey, what are you doing? But I couldn't because I was so in shock. It was like one of the most random things I've ever seen in my life. Actually, no, that's a lie. Uh, a couple weeks ago, me and my friend Khalid saw a grown woman attempt to take a shit in the middle of the street in Lower East Side, Manhattan. But that's a story for another time. And you wanna know what the worst part of this story is? Uh, after my boy Jay finally gets to my house and I explain to him what happens, I call the police and it takes them two hours to get to my house. Two hours. Orange is two miles long. Why did it take them so long to get to my house? And you wanna know what the police officer said to me when he finally got here? He said, next time it happens, just yell at the window and it will start at him. It's okay, I know your voice didn't go through the change yet, but <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? Nigga! <laughs>